kind of want to make sure that it's not, you know, your typical uh, documentary on people with disabilities with the whole, like, inspirational story arc and the, you know, the chariots of fire playing in the background and, and that kind of thing. Writing is a very lonely business. I spend a lot of time in my head, and the better part of my day is either sitting on my ass in front of the computer or sitting on my ass driving my mobility scooter. Then I heard UFC commentator Joe Rogan and Brazilian Jiu Jitsu black belt Eddie Bravo talk Jiu Jitsu on the Joe Rogan Experience podcast, and everything changed. You always know where you stand with jujitsu. It's not duplicitous, and it will not lie to you in an effort to spare your feelings, the way people do. When you're with somebody with a disability, there's sort of an automatic assumption that you're together, because society has a way of thinking like, like goes with like. But then a person with a disability with a person who is able-bodied of the opposite sex, oh, uh, and what would your brother like to order? The assumption is you're not dating. And sometimes when it becomes apparent that you are dating, they'll they'll say to the to the able bodied person, Oh, you're so you're so good for staying with him. I, like I can't believe you 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 know, you're doing that. You're such an angel. Every article I've written about sex and every uncomfortable fact I've pointed out has not changed the paradigm of how people view people with disabilities sexually. It has only reinforced that they don't view them sexually at all, and even the ones that claim to are picky and ashamed of it. Sweet. Okay. And I have uh, the next trade of Saga. And uh, Sex Criminals number two. Sex Criminals is about this woman who realizes that she can stop time with her orgasm. These two lovers on opposite ends of a galactic civil war. You see the stuff that she does. Uh, I think they might be in the bins. I don't yeah. see them here. Okay. But I could be like blind. No, I don't see them either. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Usually I get, that's such an incredible article, don't worry, it will come. And what I want is, great article, here's my pussy, I'm coming over, let's fuck. Can I get a bag? Certainly. So what's this for? Uh, they read one of my articles, they decided I'd be a good subject for a documentary. Uh, the comic that I'm working on right now is called GIMP. One of the first ones that I did was uh, from something that happened to me when I was going to university. I was crossing the street going to my class and uh, I guess a dude didn't see, didn't see me and he T-boned me on his bike and flipped over the handlebars, flipped over my lap on the scooter and ended up on his back on the other side of the scooter. I was pretty shocked and pretty like, oh my god, you just hit this dude, what the, what the fuck, like anyone would feel. He gets up, like totally fine, dusts himself off, and then comes over to me and says, are you okay? But the thing happened to him. 
a lot of people who are able-bodied ask you a question that you've heard a million times, like how fast does your scooter go? You know, what's your disability or whatever? Like they feel like they're the first people that ever that came up with that question, but they're not. It, it's like the millionth time I've had to, I've had to say, oh well, I have cerebral palsy and it's a bleed in my brain that affects uh, my muscles and balance and coordination, but it's no big deal. And you have to sort of like talk them down, like no no no, it's it's fine. But they don't really believe you. They're sort of like, oh look, he's so well adjusted. He's convinced himself that it's good to have a disability. But it is good. So I registered at 162.5, uh, but I weighed in at 140. But since uh, I'm not technically in a division yet, and they're going to create the division today for me, uh, I can, they can basically put me in whatever division that I ended up weighing in at, so it'll be uh, under 149, I think. Nice. 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 Perfect, perfect, Luis. Stay there. I've been told I have two fights, and they're trying to get a third and a fourth for me. Nice. Get us back. Get him down. Pedro Trying to get my leg out. I'm a guy who wishes for more disability. I just don't like how the world treats disability as something that you don't want to have. You don't want to be disabled. You want to be like everybody else. 